Welcome to Second Shift Gaming, everybody. Today, in Satisfactory. Got a lot going on. First, we're gonna get, we're gonna work on this factory. Sub factory. This is for the end game stuff. The base elevator. Right now, we're working on the magnetic field generator. That's what's going in this factory. That is actually going to be really easy. So I've set it all up already. Go over the wall, go down. There'll be enough electricity. Right, so because of the way I did this, one is just going to come in here. So, like so, okay. Oh no, too far away, too far away. Okay, there we go, caught ourselves. Yeah, we'll put them pointing that way. Because we have two of them right here. I always put one if we reach. Sure do. Here. So this one might actually run. Yeah, we'll put it right here. Hope it reaches. It does. Perfect. That is electromagnetic rods, batteries, all running off overflow. We are now making magnetic field generators. And this, that is what this whole platform is for. To just make base elevator stuff. And we can expand it bigger if we need to. It's probably going to get a little crazy by the time we're done. That's all right. One of them just has to go in an assembler. So that's going to be easy. We have to go to the hub and do a milestone now. We're unlocking milestones and we're actually going to unlock a geyser. Hopefully I still have all the materials. I do. Thermal propulsion rocket. Minor MK3, oh ho, and a turbo motor. Turbo motors are a little rough. And there we go. Milestone Perfect. reached. Turbo motors can now be constructed in order to build the latest fix it improved factory buildings, such yep. as the Minor Mark III. A new project part enables progress to the next phase. Yep. Start that research while we're at it, geothermal generator. For this, we need cooling systems, which means we need heat sinks, which means we need a new factory. Can't make it here. Cannot make heat sinks here. Won't work. Although, if we make them somewhere else, that'll be a different issue. A lot of logistics we have to deal with at this point in time. We are going to go build another factory though. I'll show you where we're building. I need to gather tons of supplies first. I'll see you where the new factory is going. All right, we're here. I have added a train station over here. This is going to be for heat sinks. That's what we're making over here. We need a lot of them. Before I fall out of the sky, so this was the Christmas factory. Making all the Christmas stuff. And I just didn't get it up and running before the event ended. So we didn't get it finished. So we're gonna rip all this out and we're going to make heat sinks. And heat sinks are going to need alclad sheets and copper sheets. Now, alclad sheets also need copper sheets, and that's where this train comes in because it also needs aluminum ingots. So we're going to bring aluminum ingots in, 
to here. Make so we can make alkalite sheets. So we have copper. We're gonna set this up with a MK2. And as soon as we have turbo motors, we're gonna put an MK3 over here. So we can feed this what's going to become a monstrosity. And I'm probably going to fill my inventory quite fast. But let's just empty that first. So we need the smelter still. We don't need the... Well, we'll leave the tree just because we can't build it again. Nope. And for the sake of electricity, now everything's powered. Biomass burners. That's where I was in the game when I built this. Okay, so these are need tons and tons of copper ingots. Constructor, assembler, all right, constructor, we need copper sheets. Copper sheets need 20 copper ingots per minute. These put out, what, 30? So two of them can do three of these. I think we're gonna want these. We're gonna want the. All right. Yeah, we're gonna want these over here. We want to do this different. We need we need to fit a bunch of these over here. I'm thinking we're just gonna put them somewhere here. Thirty. So that's gonna be ninety alclad sheets a minute. I don't even think I have enough to feed that. So we're actually yeah we're just gonna do three of them for the moment. And those need ten each of this copper. So actually one of those feeds all three of these. So that's gonna be 90 alkalad sheets a minute. So I need 60 copper sheets a minute. Oh, so yeah, I need six. I need six of these. Electricity, come on. So the six of these are gonna be run like this. Gotta delete all that. So this is what we've come up with so far. The two of these should be plenty.
All right, there we go. So there's the owlclad sheets. And there's the copper. Throw some walls up real quick. Obviously not putting a wall there. So these two end ones, I'm going to actually use a little differently. Let's run this straight in. This is going to go to another little factory that's going to make um, copper powder. Because I need that also. Add it to the list. But we are now making alclad sheets. We actually should be making... We are now making copper pipe. Copper sheets. Why don't you have electricity? Okay. Now they all have electricity. Now we are making copper sheets. Now hopefully there's enough room here. Good. There. Okay. This may need to move, but that's okay. Now we need an assembler again, right? Heat sinks. Heat sinks are very key. So 22 and a half copper sheets, 37 and a half alclad sheets. We're not making that much. We're just we're making what we're making. So we have 30, 30, 16. We're gonna call that 30. We're gonna say that's we'll put two. We'll put three and underclock one to a half. So we're going to put them actually going this way. Oh man, that's awesome. There we go, alclad sheets coming over. Heat sinks. Heat sink. Heat sink. It's starting to get dark. I think I think we're all set now. Merger. There we go. A little wonky, but it works. I don't like it. Perfect. Okay. So because neither of these interact with each other, I shouldn't have a need for a uh, awesome sink over here. But that's, there's the factory. Just get rid of all of this. So I'm not too worried about getting it any nicer than this. We need to get aluminum sh uh, ingots over here. And now this, need a merger. Come on, I gotta get below that. Okay, so now I can have three constructors making uh, copper powder.
Alright, so, so far, this is where we are. We have copper sheets being made, and they're going over the assemblers where heat sinks will be made. So this is going to come out, go in, you are going to go in there, because this, this is where my copper powder is going to be made. Okay, we now have copper powder factory. Once I unlock copper powder, oh, I gotta hook up electricity. Been using a lot of MK2 poles lately. It's just like that, all those are hooked up. That's good, done. And that's gonna go in here. That'll need to be sorted back at base, that's fine. That'll be fine. Gotta get, so that's, we need the aluminum ingots. We need aluminum ingots. This is done. Could use some finishing. But, I mean, for the most part, it's all set. We're needing 30... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 30 times 7. Through 10. What is this putting out? 120. So I definitely need the MK3 here as soon as possible. We need cooling sheets. Like, straight away. What's in this? We'll take all of this. We'll just leave the... We'll leave the fix mess here for now. I'm gonna take this train. Oh, we got a nice little glitching thing going on here. We'll see what happens. I hope it comes out. What's in that, what's in that car? Aluminum ingots. Why aren't they getting dropped off? There we go. All right, wait, this one, unload. This one, load. And once that train comes back, this should start running. Who knows how we're doing on electricity. Actually not bad. I don't know why. It must a bunch of a bunch of stuff must be off all of a sudden. So we're just gonna wait for the train, and then see how well this goes. All right, here comes the train. It should drop that front box off. There it goes. All right, so we have aluminum ingots here now. Here they come. There they go. There they go. All right, so now we just wait for heat sinks to start coming out. Oh, we're gonna get them soon. Our first heat sinks. There it is. First one. All right, now we have to go back. We have to go back over here. Heat sinks are gonna be used to make cooling systems, which we need a lot of. And I mean a lot of. All right, smart splitter. Let's put it right there. Straight. Heat sinks left. I don't have copper powder yet, so I can't, can't set that up. So that's going to be heat sinks coming back here. They go straight. There we go, making heat sinks. Now we need cooling systems. And those are going to be made down here. I believe I need a blender. Let's just open this one up. Yeah, cooling systems go in the blender. So I need one of those. And some heavy modular frames, which I don't have any over here. I gotta go get some heavy modular frames. 
Oh, do I have any right here? I do. Blender. Perfect. Okay, we'll put the blender right there. Oh, cooling systems. And they need a bunch of stuff. The easiest that they need, actually, is this. There we go. Rubber and heat sinks. So heat sinks. And yeah, I want... I need to move this. I don't like where it is. What did I not... I, like, really need that, too. You know what I don't need? Copper ingots. All right. That works. And we can take this. Put it all the way up here. There we go. We got heat sinks coming in. And they're even going to have a storage. Cooling systems. Rubber and water. The so water I'm going to steal right off of over there. Actually. We'll just put it coming in right here. I need a solid wall. Okay. Now we have water. We need to get rubber over here somehow. So once we get rubber over here, we'll be making cooling systems. And then that'll be it for today. Just getting a cooling system and heat sink set up. So the rubber, oh boy. We don't need that there, oh come on. All right, well, this needs to somewhere, somehow, Go into a splitter. Actually, ooh, it's just like this. We are making cooling systems. Awesome. Just like that. So, now that we're making those, we gotta get those up here. How are we gonna get those up here? Could put this here. Throw one of those right here next to it. I need more. There we go. We're making cooling systems. Go back up top. Here they come. Very nice. Very nice. Now these need to go into... I need to make turbo motors with these. So next week's episode, maybe Thursdays, we'll see. I really would like to get these going. We're going to work on turbo motors. And then once we have the turbo motors going, we're going to make the thermal pul pul propulsion. These guys. Yeah, those. I'm already making three of the four. I just need to make one more. I need the turbo motors. So we're gonna build up a stockpile of these. Hopefully some heat sinks also. We need a lot of those. If you like this video, make sure you hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. I really appreciate you watching this video. Until next time, have a great night.